stream where we're going to be playing Dwarf Fortress again, but this time I'm going to make an adventure party and we're going to try and get knock over a, a Necromancer Tower again. Why the fuck does my camera keep doing that? Hopefully it stays, but whatever. Yeah. Dwarf Fortress time, here we go. If we can fucking find it. There we go. Dwarf Fortress, start playing Adventure Time. Yep, go on those adventures and see how well we can do with this game. Let's see. I'm just gonna see what happens. Because, yeah. Hopefully it goes well. Okay, I need to fuck around with this camera so much, it's ridiculous. Uh, where is it? We are now playing the World Fortress, I think. Well, once the calendar catches up. And we're going to make a new guy. Or it's going to crash. No, it didn't crash. Oh my god. We're going to make a new guy. Okay, right. Badger Man, Blue Jay Man, Bush Tit Man. Okay, Dingo Man, Dwarf, Goblin. Elves are kind of scarce. Sparse. They're shitty, though. I don't like them. Uh, a specific person. We've got two options. Who the fuck are these people? I can't remember these guys. How did I make these? Yeah, this is a monster guy. Uh, don't know is I can't remember what the name is. Never mind. Uh, yeah, we're gonna make. Uh, I have two plans today. There was the create the Skaven from Warhammer, Just make a rat ho rat man horde, or just make a human settlement. Build a town. I mean, it could be cool to build a town on the island that we're at. And like everyone sort of just these areas. I think. Whoa. Boar men. Hmm. Let's make like a. We'll make a goblin tavern. Or no, we're going to make a party of heroes to take on the goblins and kill them. Kill all the goblins. Which is probably a hard task, I'd imagine. But we're going to knock over that necromancer tower, no problem. So, we might go for our first person will be... Um, we'll go with demigods for all of them. No, heroes for all of them. Dwarf, the first one. Uh... The Snarling Nation. Yep. There's a human hamlet. Uh, where is it we need to be beside here? Because the Necromancer Tower is just south. Never. Yeah, south. Just down the way. South. So that's where we need to head to there. So that's where we're going to start. A small hamlet. Well over 100 live there. Controlled by Hazy Society. Huh. Cause like, we could go there, but there's a mountain in the way. Now we're good where we are, cause like, we could just go down, and then we're at the Necromancer Tower. Perfect. Okay, um, you're a gem setter, human hamlet. Uh, I don't know about that. Um, first name, custom name, random name, become a dwarf. I can't remember the names of like the things. Select, re reset occupation okay it's fine we're here it is a gem sir is it a dwarf gem sir it should be a dog tamer though that uh, seems better to do that okay right next one okay what is his strengths and creativity and stuff so we're gonna make him an animal trainer and give him three dogs so that's gonna be fun. So we will give him I don't know. Empathy? Since he's a dog trainer? Maybe. And I'll just like make him strong as fuck. There you go. He's a tough old man. Tough guy with these things. Um he's uh 
don't know, he's an Axe Dwarf who's quite good at it. Competent Axe Dwarf. We'll give him some dodging. Now, where's Animal Caring at? Animal Caretaker. Animal Trainer. So we've got this guy. Animal Dissector. Hmm. He would have that skill, wouldn't he? Trapper. Oh, this is just like a trapper, like, guy. Uh, reading. Probably need to give him reading, because if he survives, he can read the Necromancer book. So that's good. And give him butchery, bone carving. Give him that. He's good at dodging, and he is. Oh, swimming. It's one point in swimming, I think. Uh, he's a good tracker. There you go. There we go. That seems like a good guy. Good skills for that guy. We'll give him. Just give him more, because he's probably going to die. But, hey. Appearance. His hair is extremely long. Her eyes. Okay, no, it's. Um, wrong thing. Wrong gender. So that's male, that one. His hair is extremely long. He is short and muscular. His extremely long, dense eyebrows are extremely low. His flattened brow ears, broad ears, and have large hanging lobes. His head is short. His eyes are short. Ears are short. Yeah, I read wrong. His slightly thin irises, gold eyes, and slightly sunken. His hair is burnt amber. His skin is pale chestnut. So he's like a ginger guy. Intense need to acquire objects. Jesus. That is a greedy dwarf. Uh, he personally would have the world operate in a com complete harmony with the least bit of strife or disorder. Sees corporates are very important in life and doesn't have a strong view on competition. He dreams of mastering a skill. Uh, uh, yeah, there you go. Equipment. So he's an axe, a knife, loincloth, skirts, robes. So pretty standard guy. Backpack, turkey intestines, how delicious. Uh, water skin and a s silk pouch. Pretty standard, yes. Oh, we can increase his quality. We'll do the dogs first. Give him some war dogs. Right, where are the war dogs? They're down here. There we go, war dogs. He will have one of them and one of them and another one. So he's got four dogs, fuck yeah. Ani, Aspica, Inid, and Ethidi. Ethby, Ethby. Okay, fair enough. Right, and then he has equipment. He can have increased quality. There we go, he's got good copper, a well crafted copper axe. Perfect. And a pine carving knife is good. Uh, we'll give him some, I'll give him a nice bat pack. There we go. A nice ass backpack and uh, nice gloves, I think. Hmm. Do we give him a helmet? Probably give him a knight. Yeah. Uh, clothes. Where are clothes? Uh, headwear. Cup. Helm. Uh, hmm. Give him a helmet because he's a dwarf guy. So he's. Um, Give him a, a dog helmet. No, you don't get that. I don't think. Uh, yeah, there's a bunch of sharks and shit. Oh, frog helm. Yes. Uh, take away the cup. Small, giant, green frog leather helm is sized for dwarfs. Is he wearing it? No, we'll take that away. Um, how do we get rid of it? Oh yeah, that. <laughs> those things. Cool, so that's him done. Um, new guy, new character. So, dwarf with dogs. That's his whole thing. He doesn't have a horse though. That's fine. 
It's totally fine. We'll get horses eventually. And the Falcon Man. Uh, uh, no, I can't be bothered with falcons because they just fly everywhere. So a dwarf, a human. No, rat man, fuck it. Rat man. A dwarf and a rat man. A snarling nations. Uh, yeah. Is he from the same town as this dude? Yeah. Yeah, so they, they live together. Those dudes. Glazer. So they kind of know each other. The cat gem card and the glazer sort of know each other. Yeah, they sort of know each other. Um, what will this guy be? That's the question. <laughs> like, what's the human guy that's coming? Is it? It's a lady, I think. Yeah. No, rat woman. What's the rat woman gonna be? <laughs> okay. So she's got a disease resistant, obviously. Uh, analytical ability focus and willpower so she's just like nah fuck that I don't know analytical ability huh and she's agile with and she's just a good talker and a meme memory so there we go so what does she do spear lady I think yes Spear lady, swimmer. She's a dodger as well. And she can bite. She's quite good at biting. She probably doesn't need a skill in that then. I bet she's just gonna bite. Yeah, that's 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 who she is. She's a little lady who bites and carves bones. I think that's what she does. She can read. Yep. Yeah. And she's a liar. Okay. Hmm. There we go. Oh, she's a comedian as well. Yeah, she's. Just... She bites things, lies, and. There we go. That's her whole arc. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. And she's good at climbing, I think. No. Ambusher. Adequate ambusher. She. Adequate. She's a skilled biter. Uh, okay then, uh, Boyer, uh, Mason, Fisher, Pottery, Woodcrafter, I mean, yeah, she could be like, nah, she carves things out of bone, because she's a fucking psychopath. Oh, I'll do. There you go. Yep. This is more power, focus, memory, linguistic ability, disease resistant, analytical ability. So, she can, yeah, she bites stuff. And she can read and she carves bone stuff. Perfect. That's a character, right? Next thing, her hair is brown, her, her skin is peach, her eyes are black. So she's a rat, basically. She personally finds even the abstract idea of romance repellent, finds the idea of independence and freedom somewhat foolish, and doesn't see much value in being stoic. She dreams of mastering a skill. So she needs to be occupied, learn something. Here, practice skills, wander, see animals. So the dogs will solve that issue of her wanting to things. So she got a whip. Yeah, she can have a whip if she wants. My little weirdo. <laughs> My little weirdo. And we'll make her naked though. Right? That could be funny. Yeah, she doesn't get a hat. Leather dress, robe. Trousers. Weird. Loincloth. So she's got trousers, a dress. No, she's got trousers, a robe, gloves, and socks, and sandals. And a backpack. Some more of them. She can have like the food of the crow kidneys. And just add another war skin, I suppose. What will she bring with her? What kind of animals will she have with her? Oh, she's got her baby with her. With, uh, that's, in this case, a rat. Just a normal-ass rat. Just with her. Because, of course, she does. Now, where are those rats at? I think it's the next page, I think. That's here. 
So she has a yes, she has a rat with her. Just one rat. That's all. And that's all she's bringing with her for that. And what shall we get? Give her. We'll give her something cool. I'll give her something cool. I think. Uh, plants. Seeds. Can you make a farm in this game? Sure, we'll give her some of these. Three seeds? Oh, I'll do four seeds. She's just carrying it for everyone. Uh, drinks? No. Digging implements? She doesn't need it with her. We will have a guy that's got that. Hmm. So she's got a whip, so that's that's fine. Ammunition, anvil, leather. Hmm. We'll give her a shield though. Yeah, we'll give her a shield. That'd be pretty cool. Yeah, there you go. She's she has a shield and she bites people, so she bashes them with the shield. Oh yeah, we we'll have to get rid of the whip, I think. Yeah, fuck it. So she just bites and hits him with a shield. That's what she does. That's her whole personality. Okay, so now we have hmm, a badger man. Fuck yeah. So we've got a dwarf, a rat, and a badger. Does the badger be the miner? I don't know. Uh, yeah, badger man. Fuck it. Snarling nations. And we'll go up to the same town. So they're all from... Abyss sound. They're all from there. Um, it's a man this time. You're a surgeon. <laughs> okay, so they have a. All right, this town is pretty cool now. <laughs> all right, next one. Okay, so he's a tough old fucker, tough old man, who's got high endurance, high that. Yeah, he's just above average toughness. He's a tough guy. Um, he's very focused, I think, and he's intimidating. Oh no, focus less, more intimidation. He's a big, intimidating, uh, and he's patient. That sounds like a psychopath. And he wields a hammer because he's a hammer guy. He can swim. No, yeah, he can swim. You can dodge things because that seems like better. Yeah, does a hammer guy just use hammers and wears thick armor? No, he's got. Hmm, he can strike like a motherfucker. There you go. And he can read. And he can write. No, wait. This is the intimidating guy. He can't read or write. Uh, intimidate. Judge of intent. So he knows, like. Yeah, there we go. It's intimidator. He can fucking intimidate the fuck out of people. There we go. He's a persuader. There we go. He is a shithead. <laughs> he is a bad person. Okay, next one. His hair is grey. His legs are black. His head is strapped white. Black and white. His skin is pink. His eyes are brown. Pretty standard badger look. Uh, she personally finds sacrifice to be the height of folly. Oh wait, no, that's, that's what the hell, Badgerman. She personally, what the fuck? <laughs> okay, she personally finds sacrifice to be height of folly. Find the artwork boring and views loyally unfavorable. She dreams of mastering a skill, so she doesn't really want Renan. She wants to be creative but hates art. What? Okay. And she likes seeing animals and hear things wonder. So, yeah, not really that bothered about anything. So, hammer guy. Let's see if we can give him a better hammer. Weapons. Uh, Copper, bronze, iron hammer, war hammer. Fuck yeah. <laughs> That's what he's gonna have. Get rid of this fucking trash. 
and then make it a cool one. There we go. It's a finely crafted thing. So he's got no mounts. He's just got a big hammer. And oh, he doesn't have a veil. Fuck that. Um, he doesn't wear a dress or a skirt. He's just got a loincloth, robe. No, he's got just a loincloth, <laughs> gloves. In he's naked. He's naked. Cool. He's partially naked. Now we'll give him something. We'll give him some clothes of some sort. Uh, wear body wear. A male shirt. Yeah. Iron. Some in iron, I think. Where's the iron stuff? Where's armor? At? Leather. 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 Where the fuck? Why can't we not get into iron? It's all leather. All leather. Still leather. Still leather. Jesus, how much fucking... Coyote leather. Okay, this just goes on forever. This list is huge. They're not armor. Is that not a thing? An option? Because I want to give him, like, something. It's not leather. Oh, a sheep now. Wool. Burn the wool back into leather. Jesus, this list is fucking huge. Let's fucking free to that list. Okay, right. Is, it, is armor an option? Or is it just is it just headwear? Clothing, is it? Yeah, it looks like it. Yep. Okay, so we're looking at bodywear. Copper. It seems to just be copper. Wool, we'll, yeah. Okay, we'll give him a bronze. Yeah. So he's got a big armor plate and a big hammer and just fucking hits things. <laughs> Can we give him like bottom half? 19 points. Can we get something for leg wear? Uh, there's some trousers. Loincloth, loincloth, loincloth. It's all loincloths. Weird. Point clothes constantly. So all lower leg wear is just loin clothes. Okay, badger leather loin cloth. Fuck it. Oh wait, no, he's already gone. Okay, there we go. <laughs> he's got gloves, socks, sandals, and there we go. He's fucking ready. He's a fucking ready man. What does he have with him though? Does he have a bear with him? Or does he have a badger? Baby alpaca, you can't take a badger with you, can you? I don't see a badger being there. Hmm. No, I don't see a badger anywhere in the list. Or unless there is. Huh. I don't know. Could have a grizzly bear, that'd be cool. Or we're getting this bloated animal fucking party. Um. Oh, he's got his friend Worm. He's got a Worm friend with him. Because <laughs> of course he does. He lives in the ground. Yeah? And a slug and a snail. There we go. <laughs> he's just a weird, scary guy who loves his little pets. This fucking party's going to die so hard. <laughs> and we've got... Do we have weird necromancer monster? Will we have that? Because mm. last time I had the hands of Mistem, and that was like kind of a night creature, and he was kind of cool, but then he got his feet cut off. Fuck it, we'll go with that. And he is from the same place, maybe? Sure. Sure, we'll go to the same place as everyone else. Where the fuck is it? Oh, does he not have that option? Oh, weird. It's from here. I'll do. He's a carpenter with no eyes. No fucking eyes. <laughs> so what does he do? Oh, he's just the miner, I think. He's like the mole man. Yeah? Yeah. There we go. Uh, we'll give him, like, just strength. 
and agility that is just super fucking strong. <laughs> and we'll make him a miner. There we go. He's a miner. I mean, he could be like the. He's dumb as fuck. He's a carpenter, miner. Yeah, he can't read or write. He's just dumb. <laughs> he's just a dumbass. Who uses his axe because he's a carpenter and he uses an axe. So, look at that swimmer, ambusher, dodger. Yeah, you can dodge things. You can strike things as well. Real hard because he's a, he's a carpenter. So, uh, woodcutter. Yeah, if we build the town, he can be the guy. Engraver. Oh wait, no, he's dumb. He can't do that. <laughs> Weaponsmith, armorsmith, furnace, furnace operator. No, you can learn all these things, right? I think you can. Sure. You can learn all these things. Sure, you can. Grower? There you go. <laughs> it's all these things. Weird. Okay. Oh, and he dances like a motherfucker. So he's just a dumb, strong guy who mines. And yeah, that's it. He's an adequate miner or competent miner. There we go. That is fucking a proficient as fuck miner. Yes. Um, oh, he's the thing that lives in the ground. <laughs> he's got no eyes, and he's a thing. She personally doesn't think much about the ideas of preser pre perseverance. She dreams of mastering a skill. So she can't see, but that doesn't matter. Because it's just got standard clothes, doesn't he? Anything special. I mean, maybe we'll give him like the things, the seeds and shit to making a town, right? I don't know. Do we have seeds to like, we have more than that seeds? Oh, we do. Okay, cool. Um, we can make carrot seeds, lentils, soybeans. I'll oh, we'll go with carrot seeds. We'll go with like, like a bunch of them. I don't even know if you can actually grow things in this. Uh, some wine. No, I'll do. Oh, two battle axes. Mmm. Is that a thing? No. <laughs> Can't do that, I don't think. What else shall we bring? Oh, a digging implement. Iron pickaxe. That used up a bit of points. And we will do extracts. Just a bag of blood. Tools. Do we have any tools that we need? Altar, pedestal, bookcases, hammer. A boning knife, slicing knife. Nah, that's nothing really needed. Cups and goblets. Um, a granite mug. Sure, has a granite mug with them. Add some more wine, and we're done with all the points. Cool. Right, that's the person's done. Last member of the hero party. So we've got dwarf. Rat lady who bites things. Something. <laughs> and then something else. I can't remember. Fuck. Okay then. Um, let's make something fun this time. Something stupid. Um, we've probably made something stupid up to this point as well. Um, I'll do a goblin maybe? Yeah, I'll do a goblin. Who's from the Snarling Nations. And where is that town at? A little town that everyone's from. Abyss Sound. There we go. A Miller. Perfect. Oh, yeah. It's a male goblin, I think. Is that how you change it? I have no idea. Alright. A goblin. What would a goblin be good at? Ah, oh, yeah. We'll just make him like the creative or a person who isn't in for anything 
is the part musicality sure there we go so the person is linguistic ability yeah Oh shit, I could actually go back and do that. Oh, so that's the dwarf. That's the rat lady. That's the badger man who's scary. Okay, and then the minor guy. Okay, so pink hole. Skills. Didn't know you could do this. Uh, where is that? that? Hmm. Where's intelligence at? Creativity and <laughs> Social awareness? Just empathy. He has no empathy. No kinetic sense. Uh, okay, it's so just average. Average. He's got no musical musicality. No, lin <laughs> no memory. No patience. No memory. Uh, Above intention, creativity, uh, no analytic. <laughs> there we go. That's some fucking shit. And it's a pure shadow. You can't add anymore. Uh, we'll give him that, I suppose. Uh, and some toughness. Oh, yeah, no, no kinetic sense. And we'll just add toughness. Oh, endurance. There we go. Okay. Goblin prison. That'll be the end of the party. Five people. That's a pretty... That's pretty much a good thing. So this is the creative art person. In the... In the party. The bard, if anything. Uh, the focus. There we go. And the bard shall have a crossbow. Because that makes sense. Yeah, fuck that. Um, dodger. Adequate dodger. Um, you can throw things. Okay, so you can read, writing, poet, speaker, musician, singer. So just. And he plays a flute thing. Perfect. Uh, and he's a comedian as well. Maybe. Yep, maybe. Uh, oh, he's conversationalist. There we go. Oh, I can dance as well. Precisionist. Okay. Weird. Uh, play wind instruments. You can just all round be a bard. Look at that. Perfect. Good at everything. Start. His hair is extremely long. His sunken red eyes are very round. She is thin, she has a round chin, her lips are slightly thick, her nose bridge is slightly convex, her hair is tall, her head is tall, weird. Her free loading lobed eye ears are somewhat narrow, her hair is maro maroon, her hair is grey. Oh, that's an interesting fucking... She's a person who doesn't see much value in being stoic, she dreams of seeing the great natural, natural places of the world. So this is a pretty standard lady. Uh, crossbow, I'll keep it more than that. Like a good 40, maybe? There we go, yeah. She's got a quiver, pretty standard shit. Uh... Ah, she's got an instrument already. A string thing. A string thing, yeah. There you go. Bard lady. <laughs> Perfect. Who, um, I don't know what else to give her. I'll give her a different instruments. Where are they at? Huh. Where are they at? Instruments, right here. So, what's this? I'm in that hand straight. Metal horn, the music blow into the instrument, select pitch and resonant airflow out of the bells. Okay, so she's got, yeah, string and that. Hmm. Yeah, there we go. 
Did you have a toy with her? Or she has a puzzle boxes with her? <laughs> sure. Yeah, right. A silver puzzle box. Perfect. Okay then. And I think we may be done. Yeah. We might actually be done. I just have a cut. Can we have a cut? Got 17 points. Can we have a cut? Where's the cuts at? Cut. We can have a cut. The bard has a cut with her. Perfect. And that's where we're going to start. So we have to go up, go north, and then across. Okay. Go. Don't crash, please. Don't crash. <laughs> Ooh. After a long journey, you're together with your companions again. Abby, Abe is from here and might have some local information. Let's party forth. Okay. I have forgotten all the controls. Key bindings. Um, what can you change? Change another party member. Okay. Right. So this person is the... Huh. I should have learned the people. What does he have with him? Hmm. So he's not the badger man. No, I think he's a dwarf. I think. <laughs> nope. L U. E. Um, description. We should all be one. We are all struggling. Uh, weird. Description. A short, stubborn creature. Dark. Drink and industrious. Okay, so that's the dwarf, I think. I think. Ooh. Oh, why did you drop the mug? Ooh. We're all out. We're all out of the thing, maybe. What is going on now? Okay, so. Oh. Why. Why is everyone on the ground? Abe. He's the party leader, I think. No, he's not. <laughs> no, he's not. That's not either. This guy is. The dog guy? Yeah. Yeah, he's a leader of the party. So. Ooh. I've never looked at this menu before. So we're having a wee look at this. Um. So with them. Um, mm, okay. View map. M. Ooh. There we go. So. The eye is here, I think. Yes, it's here. It's this place here. Right here. Let's fucking do that. Okay, we're gonna move up the way? Out of this town, I think. Yeah. And then across, maybe? Can we get across the river without dying? No, we can't. Oh, that's weird. It's very strange. Where are we now? How odd. There's no way across. It's very strange. Oh no, there we are. We're still not across. Shit. Oh, here we are. Here's a place. And then it was somewhere. Okay, so we're going down the way? We shouldn't be doing that. We should be going up the way. I think. Yes. We should be going up. Across the river. And then up. How are we going? Where are we going? Yes, we're getting there. 
Because we'll go over this way. There's no one hungry or anything. Doesn't look like it. Ooh. You feel uneasy. What's here? I've been causing so much hardship. Hamlet called Tinkle Pelt somewhere in the musical prairies. Okay then. It's not everyone here. Where is everyone? Where is everyone? Are they all here? Yeah, they're all here. Okay, never mind. Terrifying. Are they all scared of him? <laughs> they're all scared of their own party member. Weird. So what the fuck made it uneasy? Alright. Well, fuck it. Right? No, we're not going there. We're aiming for like here. Like this area? Like there? Yeah. So this way. Kind of travel through a monastery. Ooh, a monastery. Let's see. Let's investigate that shit. Okay. A bunch of shit happened. Monastery. Here it is. Uh, oh, what's in here? Just tables and chairs. That's weird. Okay. Where's this temp monastery? Is that it? Is that the whole monastery? Okay then, fair enough. Oh no, we've got more adventures up here. Huh. Huh. No one's sleepy though, are they? They're not hungry. Clearly not. There's nothing in here. Weird. Oh, okay, that scared me a little bit. Ah, oh, fountain! That's pretty cool. Topa statue of the certain. Certain? Certain. Oh, cool. Oh, that's interesting. Ooh. Is this a dice thing that we can do? Um, cubic dice. Yes. Ooh. Hello. So interact was um, hold on or something. Oh, it's interact, was it? Interact, interact with. Yeah. Interact with. Weird. Is it on the ground? How do you do these things? How do you throw dice and stuff? Pick up an item, talk, shout, spirit, look around, movement options, put an item in the container, place an item, pack it away. Um, weird. What was the pick up item? I might not pass. Uh, pick up item. G. Uh, Yes. Okay then. And then interact with a dice, wherever the fuck it is. B. Roll it. Roll defining the will of the certain according to the principle of doctrine. Um, lands on its thin cross. Joy is in the horizon. That's cool. Okay then. Hi hey, everyone. We've got joy in the horizon, so ain't that fucking cool, right? It's apparently cool. Can we move? Okay, we can't move for some reason. Oh, no, they're all hungry. Tired. <laughs> Is he just a weird creature? Okay. 
it um, see it more okay does everyone do that did everyone do that no who Abe not him why the fuck why is he on the ground idol okay all right well therefore all right we're getting there we get into that fucking place right. okay so we are to turn this way I suppose and the necromancer tower is it's close okay Z nope confirm uh, till dawn D yes oh shit there's something there mm-hmm okay so we woke up thirsty and hungry I'm gonna eat um, see uh, e. Did everyone drink water? It's good to see you, a friend like you. Okay. Who? I keep forgetting who everyone is. Who am I controlling right now? Oh, I have my cat. <laughs> Keep being scared by the guy that's in your team. Okay, we need to sleep more then. Clearly, because it didn't fucking work. <laughs> Jesus. Eight hours. How about like two hours? There we go. Wake up, everyone. We're traveling again. Oh, there it is. There it fucking is. It's up there. There's the Necromancer Tower. So can we go over? Is there a way to go around them? Okay, yeah, there is. Now can we go up and then down? Is that what we can do? Hopefully that's what we can do. Nah, it looks like we might have to go through the mountains. Which is garbage if we do have to do that. Ooh, just tail away that thing. A monastery. Yeah. Okay, and we've stopped. Everyone's hungry and thirsty still. For some reason, he's thirsty as always. C and E. Run out of war. There's war in the mountains, so we'll go in the mountains. Perfect. This party of adventurers need to knock over this fucking. We're gonna bottle this fucking place. We're gonna bottle the necromancer. I think. And we're not even close to being over. The mountains. Not even close. We're getting there though. They're all tired for some reason. Wait. Why are they on the ground? <laughs> Everyone's on the ground for some reason. Okay. Movement. Um. Movement hook. Um. Movement type. How do you do that again? Okay. Right. This. Scramble. What the fuck? Get up. Too tired to stand. They're all tired. What the fuck? Why are they all tired? Eight hours. Yes. Sleep eight hours. As we're going through the mountains. Perfect. Perfect. Good. Till dawn. Yes. Till the sun comes up. Please. 
would be nice. And we've somehow woken up for some whatever fucking reason. Um, like two hours? Yes. Wake up. Everyone, wake up. <laughs> okay. Alright. No, not him. There we go. This badger guy. It probably is. <laughs> is this. Is this. Um... Yep. I don't know. Yeah, I think so. That's dog guy, I think. Ooh, discovered a river. Ooh, actually, a rut. You know, fill our skins. Um, poor skin. Oh, uh, fill. Yes. You gonna fill yours as well? Hey. Right. To get across this water, where the fuck are we gonna go and do that? Uh huh. Right. To get across this river, it's just right there. We're right there. We're so close. Okay. So we could die swimming. So we'll go and find a way across this river. Because there's goats and shit over there. So we're gonna attack the goats, I think. Yeah. Oh, they're just petting the dogs. That's cute. Okay. Is there a way across the fucking river? We just have to do it, don't we? Yep. Did everyone get across? Everyone got across. Okay, everyone did it. I think. Yeah, everyone got here. No one died. Not one person died. Did we get over the mountains? No. We're still have a bit to go. Come on everyone, we'll make this. Oh, there's goats down this way, wasn't there? Yeah. Strong order, none. Ooh. What happened? Hello, great to see like you okay. So he's just talking amongst themselves. Where is actually the... We're just walking. Okay, where was that goats at? Where were those goats? Okay, what happened? Stands up. Why is everyone falling over? Weird. Okay. So we found where it was before. The river. I don't think there's any goats though. Hmm. Hopefully we can find goat soon. Cause I think we need food soon. I think. Yeah, we'll need this food soon. We're climbing up a mountain though. So there's always that. We're gonna get across this fucking mountain. And where are we now? We are I don't know. I cannot see where we are. What the fuck? Where are we? Oh yeah. Fucking still ages away. We're getting all these fucking mountains. And we have no food. No food whatsoever. We can kill the dogs, but that's kinda that's kinda not good. Oh, what happened there? A mountain goat kicks Asuka in the third left front to a right for hoof. Sharing the nail. Bends the left for what the hell? Licks herself. Where's this go at? Where is it? Where did the go go? How do we start attacks? <laughs> Key bindings. Um, weird. Jump off cliffs. Okay, then. Um, I've done all this shit before, but I don't I can't remember how to do it. Okay. 
weird. It's very strange. It's very strange indeed. Oh, there we go. Could we just tag the goats, maybe? Where did the goats go? I did kill goats. Oh, there it is. What's this dog doing? What the hell's going on? Inbis? That's a dog, I think. Let's defeat many fearsome opponents. Okay. So the dogs are just like doing stuff. Okay. Well. Why is everyone on the ground? Okay, well, we'll eventually get there, hopefully. Fuck me. <laughs> We're still not out of the mountains yet. And everyone's hungry, again. We've got war at least. Okay, eat. Jesus Christ. What the fuck? Drink war covering. <laughs> Weird, so they're wet, and you just okay. So you're still thirsty somehow. What the hell? Why has he got war on him? Okay, strange. That's very strange. Weird. Okay, so yeah. <laughs> He's drinking the rain at this point. Fucking hell, we're getting there. We'll eventually get there. Is everyone okay? Everyone else is fine, except for this guy, who's thirsty. Okay. Are we out of the mountains yet, for fuck's sake? Almost out of the mountains. Almost. This adventurous party is not going very well. Are we out of the forest? It looks like we may be. We might be out of... Yes, we are, I think. No, almost out. Almost out. There's just a bit of wood here. A little bit of trees and stuff. So I'm going to do a little bit of a woods. Jesus. Are we getting out of here? Any kind of... Is that water? It's a downward slope. Well, it is. A downward slope in the water. Interact. Um, water skin. Oh. Yes. That's pretty cool. Eat. Drink stagnant water. Okay. Sure. Oh no, that's disgusting. Okay. Cool. Never mind then, that word isn't good. Um, P? There's nothing to do with the stagnant war. Dunk it out! That's what you need to do. Uh, fire projectile. No, nope. throw something. Um, let's just throw the war then. E. Yep. Throw the war out. Um, e. T. E. There we go. Throw the war out. You can't drink it because it's disgusting, apparently. Oh, a rabbit. Where's this? the guy with a crossbow? Does he have a crossbow? Who has a crossbow? Um. Iron Warhammer. Um, nope. Who's the one with the cross? But there we go. Um, how do you fire projectiles? Fire projectile. F. Art the rabbit. Ooh. What happened there? 
living in fear, the hamlet called to somewhere with him. Okay. Did that do anything? You missed, didn't you? You fucking loser. Yeah, you missed. Yeah, fire. <laughs> Let's see if you can get this rather. I'm guessing you missed. You missed nothing. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. Oh, we're out. And now we're about to go up the way. Yes. Oh, we'll stop here actually. Let's go to the river. Because he's thirsty. And you can drink river water. What's that over there? What is that thing? Groundhog. Right, well, we don't have any food right now. So. Uh, where's the war skin? Oh. Yes. Eat. Hmm. Cool. Eat. Nerds. Oh, yeah. Alright, get off this menu. And we'll get. Alright, we are here. We're here now. And it's night time! Brilliant! That's <laughs> what I wanted. Night hours. Oh, there we go. Alright. Stunned? Why? Weird. Why is he stunned? That's very strange. Okay. Right, well. Get up then. <laughs> Off to go. Beat his necromancer. I suppose that's what we're doing now. Where was the necromancer I tower at? M. So where are we? Oh, it's just right in front of us. Just right there. Right there. The Scroop Splash Tower. Cool. Right. Well, we're going in, I suppose. Oh! What happened? Mount Goats kicks the dog. Okay. Okay. How do we attack though? What the fuck? Okay. Weird. What the fuck happened? Jumps away. Okay. Right. Wait, well, you killed the goat then? Charges from behind, collapses with imbus, downs backwards. So there's there's just combat happening. Are you not gonna help it fight? The mountain goat falls over. Where is it? Where is the goat? Where'd it go? Did it fucking escape? These dogs are useless. Uh, draws, draws, pick, draws, pull from his left hand. Mango falls over. Okay. Weird. So we're just all falling over. For some reason. Okay then. So go go away then. Where the fuck is this necromancer tower at? Are we on top of it yet? Okay. So we're in the forest, that's why we can't fast travel apparently. We're gonna get there though. Right. Where the fuck is this necromancer tower at? So I think we're in this garbage territory now, I think. Oh! What the hell is this? Where are we? 
right in the necromancer tower right now what is this okay then we are in approaching the necromancer tower I think didn't look like that last time we came is that it? is this it? is this the tower? I think this may be the tower that wasn't where we were before was it? Okay then. Oh, nothing. Okay. There's nothing up here. Cool. Nothing up here. Why does everyone keep falling over? Like, look at this. Everyone keeps falling over. <sighs> why? Just why? Why are these random buildings just like here? We're gonna get there though. We're gonna do this shit. And it fucking kills us. Can't travel to leave the site. Okay, so we look down. Oh, yeah. We're getting there. We're gonna fucking murder these fucking people. Oh, what's that? What's that thing? A frail human corpse. We'll approach it, I suppose. Ooh, dogs are off. Ooh. 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 What's going on? Um, latches on firmly. Corpse bites. In the left paw, tears muscle. Okay, so it's just dogs are tugging, I think. I think. Or is everyone doing that? Breaks grip tooth. Okay. Alright, Jesus. What is going on with this shit? Oh. Lama wool trousers is ripped and shredded. Can we defeat this thing? Nope. Apparently not. Oh, hello. What happened? Okay. Combat locks. Okay, so we get to the beginning. We'll go back to the beginning, right? So the dog attacks, dog attacks, frail human loses hold of goose leather mitten. Okay, no it doesn't. So Asuka latches on firmly, Ani latches on firmly. It was bites frail human corpse, tearing muscle through its large panda leather hood. So just fucking tore it to bits. Frail human corpse stabs in the left front leg with a bronze bone, boning knife. Latches on firmly, bites, tears, human, frail human, corpse, okay. Tensi scratches a frail human corpse in the left arm, a tennis torch. So they're just fucking murdering this thing. The frail human corpse is lashes in the right rear leg with a bronze thingy. Okay then. So just a bunch of stuff happens. Okay, what happened? Fail human slashes left leg in in this falls over. Uh, scratches a frail human corpse neck near the muscle. Strikes a frail human corpse head with a turnip seed. What the fuck? <laughs> she hit it with a seed, bruising the muscle and force pulls the neck. Scratches a frail human corpse in the third finger, left finger, frail bone. The force twists its left hand. Frail human corpse in the lower body, bruising the muscle through its legs, and latches on firmly, strikes the frail human in the head with an iron pick and severs the head, sailing off. Fuck yeah. So the guy that I thought was just going to be a shitty sort of... Oh, here comes another one. Oh, get up. Oh. Oh, shit. Okay. There's a lot of shit happening there. A lot of red. The muscular human corpse slashes. Ah, oh, fucking him again. 
Spawning knife. Attack skulls. Torn. Ooh. Uh, part of the five bruising spine. Tissue attendant upper spine is bruised. Bites the muscular human in the upper body, bruising the fat through the. Okay, stretches the movement muscles. So that bitch is fucking grabbing on and biting him and pulling bits off of him. Strikes a human corpse in the lower body with a turnip seed. This fucking turnip seed, Kara, stop with a turnip seed. Oh, she breaks the turnip seed on his head. Must have been in the upper body, so she bites him again. Tearing his cloak open, scratches the muscular man of corpse in the left lower arm, bruising the muscle, throwing the large sheep wool, force it twist left elbow, it strikes the muscular man in the lower body and turn it with the turn. So she's just biting and hitting people with turnip seeds. Yep. <laughs> and she broke another turnip seed. Slashes tail, his copper bone and knife, tearing apart the fat. Oh. So the rat lady's getting all fucked up. Okay, so she bites him again, scratches him, strikes him on the head with a turnip seed. Why is there a turnip seed? This is the best turnip seed fight ever. Bites muscular man in the lower body, bruises him, latches on firmly. Okay, so she's just fucking him up. Ooh. So she hits him again. Get up, dude! Jesus Christ. Oh! With a carrot seed? Oh, been struck down. How did he die? Oh. What the hell did I do? Did he sheath the fucking weapon? Draw weapons. You draw your couple of bugs. What is all these bones and shit? What the fuck? Large sandal imprint. Mm. Frail human corpse. So she just fucking fucked his teeth up. Okay. Uh, did they kill it? Who's dead? Anyone dead? Dog blood. Um. Large boning knife, climb cloth, yeah. Okay, well, we'll pick that up then, I suppose. How do I pick up things again? Fuck my brain today. Um, why, why can't I work out how to do shit today? I don't know. G. Pawning knife. G. Uh, is there anything? Veil, mitten, sandal. Nothing really. Okay. So I've killed two necromancer monsters. And these are. It's a. It's a statue to. Where? Chamel? Okay. Alright, so we're going up the tower, I suppose. What's up here? Nothing. Okay, cool. Stand up. Who's bleeding everywhere? Okay, right. Have a look through the party. Oh. Everyone's fine, apparently. That's cool, then. Everyone's fine, except for the dogs. That's probably... Ooh. Which one's hurting? Ooh, yeah, look. Okay. These fucking dogs are covered in blood. Oh, that one's fucking... That one's gonna die. <laughs> Definitely gonna die. We're not even close to the fucking Necromancer's Tower, though. Okay, we're getting there. We will get there, eventually. We will definitely get there eventually. What was this? Oh, another one. Fuck. Oh, 
Ooh, shit. So just the dogs have been sent off now. Just now, it's just dogs fighting. And dumbass pickaxe man. Muscular man, corpse loses all of its large reindeer mitten. So it cut its hand off. Did it? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, scratch the muscular man, the must through. For, force bends the right knee. Muscular attack jumps away. Okay. Weird. Muscular man draws copper carving knife in the right hand. Dabbing and in the left. Uh, chipping the bone. Oh shit! Annie falls over. Mm. Okay. Kicks the body. Pretty fat. These dogs are getting fucked up. Okay. And it's more than just that though. She's ripping clothes off. That rat lady. Mhm. Mm Head glances away. Rip shreds. Ooh. I bite the muscular man on the head, tearing the muzzle. I latch him firmly. Okay, curved bite in the leg, I like tearing the fat. And I scratch the muscular man on the head, tearing the muscle, forcing bruising the skin. She breaks his trousers. Pulls on embedded iron picks, gains possession of the iron pick. He's fucking him up. Flying copper bolt strikes the muscular part in the throat, tearing it. Neck tearing apart the skin. Yeah! Was struck down. Uh, scratches the human corpse in the left cheek, tearing it, force pulls the head. She pulled his head off with a bite. Loses hold of his large rope reed. Head veil. That's funny. Ali strikes the muscular man corpse in the head with the iron pickaxe and severs the part sailing off in the arc. He's a big dumb idiot who can fucking hit. Okay, cool. Hooray. I did that. We've done it. Uh, I don't need anything, I think. Is this the Necro Tower here? Necromancer's Tower right here. It could be. Definitely could be. Doesn't seem like it is though. That's just a weird tower. Okay. Oh, yeah. Get up. Stop flying down, prison. Right. Where is this necromancer's tower? Okay. Right. Down this way. We'll get there eventually. Come on, everyone. <laughs> we'll get this tower eventually. We've kind of just murdered people. Okay, here it is. I'm pretty sure this is it. Yeah, this is the tower. This is definitely the tower. Why can't I move as much as before? Is it freezing the game? Oh no, we're moving. Should probably save. Save game. No, we're gonna save here, and we're gonna go down and fuck that necro tower up, and that's gonna be the video, I think, today. Yeah, we're gonna fuck that tower up, I think. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna fuck the tower up, and we'll do it. We move through the Necromancer's minions, killed three of them, or four of them. Dogs did most of the damage, though. But, hey, fuck it. We're saving the game here, and we're gonna go do it. We're gonna see who dies. Because those dogs are very, very efficient. I feel like. If I make a fortress, I should just make it with dogs, right? Continue playing, yes. Yes. Be these adventurers. Hopefully everyone's in the same place as they were. Hopefully. Hopefully everyone's there. But if not, oh well. Everyone's here. Cool. And we can't, like, go down this bit? Oh yeah, we gotta go around it. We'll go down here. Up here. Can we go down into the necro tower? Is that where we're going? Yes, we are. We are going down into this. Oh, I see one already. What is this one? What is this thing here? Narnos Goblin Hammerman. Okay. 
Does he have an ill intent towards us? He doesn't seem to. Okay. Um, I don't think he's got any ill intent towards us. I don't think so, anyway. The dogs would fucking run at them. Oh, the dogs are fucking up. Oh, they're out. They're done already. And the lady's off, too. She's off running. Where are these dogs going? Where'd everyone go? <laughs> what the fuck is everyone doing? Corpse misses Abu. What is going on here? Okay. Is that one of our things? That was one of our people, isn't it? It's that lady. Badger man. No, I don't think so. Did one of our team mates die? Earl, man of our corpses, misses Abby. Abby strikes corpse. Okay. With her iron pick, the severs part of the sails and arc. Oh, okay. So it's not one of our teammates then. A battle, I feel very uneasy. Okay. Get in there and fucking kill this fucking person. <gasps> muscular dwarf, bard, necromancer punches the muscular man in the form, cool lower body. Okay. Right. What is going on here? I don't understand. What the fuck is going on? Muscular human forlorn ghoul breaks the grip of muscular dwarf bard necromancer upper body. Okay. So they're fighting in themselves, I think. Beast hunter necromancer. Is he dead? Nope. And that person is there. Muscular man, ghoul. Hmm. Statue. Statue of human. Okay. Okay then. Silver slicing, ripped to shred, forces the left knee. The muscular ghoul pulls on. Okay. Weird. Oh, is the necromancer there as well? Okay. We'll kill that thing then. Yeah, attack that fucking thing. Oh, yes. Strike him. Right in the fucking head. Um, neck. Hell yeah. Uh, okay. When you hack the narrow chinned dwarf necromancer in the neck and behind with your copper balax bruising the muscle through the water buffalo leather cloak, the human is stabs the muscular dwarf in the left upper leg. So this is just like a ghoul. Fighting the necromancer, friendly in the wound, the muscular <laughs> punches the muscular for in the left hand. Okay. There's more than one necromancer. That's what it looks like. Lethal. Was yielding. Attack anyway. Yes. <laughs> yes. Do the. Hug him. Uh, okay. And our chin falls over. You hack the, the upper body behind with the bruise thing. I have part in this. I have a part in this. I will have my revenge. The muscular human ghoul slashes the muscular in the left upper arm. A motor nerve was been severed. The silver slicing knife was lodged firmly in the wound. A muscular human is. Flicking motion in the muscular bird feels sick. Okay, cool. Are we attacking or what are we doing? We are. Ooh. How oh, crazy. So my part is just like. Fuck it. Hell yes. 
Musket Dwarf Bard. Who is doing these things? Omaha bashes the narrowhead dwarf beast hunter necromancer and right arm from behind iron war hammer jamming bone to the right shoulder muscular and tearing the muscular shoulder apart okay continue latches on firmly tearing the left eyelid skin through the pocket cloak fuck okay dead um uh, monsters there necromancer <laughs> all end so quickly. Begone, fear. Narrow hunter neck. There's fighting. I'm uneasy. The narrow necron breaks the grip of teeth. Narrow hunter left eye. She bit him in the eye. She bit him in the eye. Punches the dwarf bard. Necromancer in the left lower arm. Left handed injury. <laughs> Part collapses. The muscular dwarf has been struck. So, who's all here? Who's alive? This is very confusing. Okay, no quarter, a narrow hit. Yeah? I'm guessing he's dead then. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> Who died? Again. Talks the narrow to Narcrobots and rolls away. Okay, human muscular ghoul makes a flicking motion. The muscular dwarf bard necromancer looks sick. The human ghoul slashes that. The silver slicing the lodge from the wound. Muscular dwarf bard <laughs> struck down. The narrow eyed necromancer gestures. The muscular goes <laughs> and begins to move. Cool. So there's two of them. Okay. Oh hell yeah! Someone else died. Um, has been stunned. Ooh. Okay. All right. This took a bit of fucking fighting. Jesus Christ! What's going on? <laughs> okay, so we're fighting it then. The narrow necromancer breaks grip. Uh, teeth. The muscular dwarf micro punch punches the muscular human. Is he not dead yet? No, he came back to life again. Then struck down. So we beat him again. Becomes looks sick. The muscular dwarf bard necromancer vomits blood. Necromancer the muscular dwarf bard shrugs and begins to move. Beats hunter becomes necromancer shakes around the, by the head. Hunter necromancer shakes. Asuka around by the head, tearing apart the head, muscular, and tearing apart the upper spine, narrow, nervous tissue, the ar artery in the head has been opened by the attack, a tendon in the upper spine has been torn, narrow chin, death is the truly horrifying, the narrow ear, hunter, necromancer shakes around the head, tearing the muscle, attacks torn apart, narrow beast hunter becomes necromancer in the right lower arm, tearing... Where is the guy that we need to kill? Oh. Okay. Right. Where's the fucking... Is it him? No. This one. Muscular dwarf. Or is it this one? Yeah, it's that one. Oh no! Strike. Um. It's really the head or neck. Oh shit! <laughs> okay, so I did it. I think the muscular dwarf gestures. Okay. Hunter Necromancer misses you. The Necromancer, the muscular dwarf bard Necromancer was struck down. The, the narrow chin bar <laughs> gestures Doruk. His neck shudders and begins to move. Oh. And Rekman gestures the muscular. And the narrow one, Rekman loses hold of his robe, head, 
Well, my veil. So he's it. You hack the the narrow ear dwarf beast hunter necromancer in the neck with your copper battle axe and sever his sails off in an arc. Okay. So. This is a messy fight. Who's still alive? I don't from the corpse behind you from behind. So in this frosty of a uh, corpse onslaught corpse collapses with Oh I need to get the fuck out of here. Okay. Okay. Jesus. A lot of stuff happened there. I'm bleeding, apparently. <laughs> this tower is fucked up. Jesus. You get out of here, dude. Uh, okay. This is a hell place we're at. <laughs> we are in hell. Jesus Christ. So just. Uh, fighting us. No. Oh my god. Wait. Nick. Jesus. Deep voiced human beast hunter. Who's doing this? Strike. <laughs> it's just, they're just taking him back to life, aren't they? Ooh, did I get someone? Okay. So we're just. I have no idea what the fuck I'm doing right now, <laughs> but oh well. Uh, deep voice human necromancer released the grip of a deep voice human beast on her left lower arm, the first hawk's neck, and the neck with your tears apart muscle. Deep voice scrubs and a tooth necromancer has been struck down. Uh, okay, don't scratches Dodak tears apart side tearing muscle through the rope. Uh, it's been stunned. The deep voice human and an acrobat suggestions begins to move. Must be human. <laughs> okay, so attack, attack, no quarter, neck attacking you. P. A. Bam. Whoa. Truly horrifying. It is. It is truly horrifying. Oh my god. <laughs> what is going on in here? This is just death. I have no idea where the fuck I am anymore. Who am I even being? This is just death. I need out of here. I want out of here. Oh, Jesus. Is he fucking evil now? We'll just we'll fight you here, then, I suppose. Jesus. Overexerted, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Jesus. He's fucked up. <sighs> Who am I playing as? Just fuck. Oh my god. This is 
truly horrific. This is truly horrific. My god. No core right arm. Yeah. Oh my god. How do we get out of here? Jesus Christ, this is just not going well. What is going on here? Okay. the fuck yes yes I do want to confirm strike him in the neck upper body oh, lower body <laughs> okay right. who's alive and who's dead oh my god this is a uh, Oh dear God! Yes. Okay. See. Jesus Christ. No. <laughs> Wonder things. No. Okay, everyone. Out of here. Jesus made it out. I don't know if anyone made it out here. There's a thing coming. Well, that's everyone. Unconscious. On ground. Is everyone alive? <laughs> Barely. Barely alive. Anyway, yep. That went well. So, next stream, we'll be back doing the same thing and we'll see what happens. <laughs> but no, that was pretty fun. That was pretty dumb. But, like, yeah. No idea what was going on. Necromancers are harder to take out than I thought. <laughs> but oh well. Yeah. Hope you enjoyed that chaos. So, see you later.